Did you know that there are some life hacks, life hacks, if you will, that support you in coping with stress? And in the introduction to this series on building your self-empowerment with tools for coping with stress, I gave you a meditation, coping with stress, a meditation for body balance. I've linked it again in the show notes, along with the other parts of this five-part series as it continues to build. My name is Robin Richards, and I am your wellness teacher who is dedicated to empowering you with the absolute best information that merges science with the world of holistic so that you can build mindset and energy techniques for lifelong wellness that works. And all of this focus on inner fitness practices and simple nutrition strategies are all going to inevitably change your life and your holistic health. Now, meditation is a powerful practice for changing the way that you think. Literally, it reprograms your brain for renewal and resilience, especially around coping with stress, but really for enjoying that holistic lifelong wellness that we're all after. So please continue to utilize that tool. But for today, I want to deliver to you some really powerful, simple nutrition strategies that are going to support you in coping with stress and building lifelong wellness from the inside out. So let's begin. Now, we need to review that stress is natural and it's normal and your body is incredibly designed to be in homeostasis, which is a balanced state, including dealing with stress. But the issue comes with modern life. And per modern life is providing too much stimulation, too many prolonged states of stress and chronic states of stress, which are extremely detrimental to your holistic health. But don't distress. <laughs> Pun totally intended there. There's always hope, especially when you lean on simple nutrition and inner fitness. So when you focus on simple nutrition, you're looking at food being the fuel that your body needs to function. And if your food is focused on items that are causing inflammation and dysregulation in your body, your food is actually going to do the opposite of supporting you in coping with stress. It's causing more stress by increasing your toxic load and the strain that it's causing on your body's systems. So that being said, I am not going to focus on what not to eat. You see, where your attention goes, your energy flows. So if you focus on what not to eat, you shift into a scarcity fixed mindset and your brain may not register the not and will focus on the food that's causing the stress, perhaps even inserting judgment in your brain and judgment is a form of stress in and of itself. So allow yourself with me now to bring attention to simple nutrition that is readily available and that supports you in coping with stress. Let's begin by focusing on foods that come from the earth. Read your ingredient labels and choose processed and packaged foods that have the lesser of the list of ingredients. The fewer ingredients, the better. And oh my goodness, if you can actually say the words that the ingredients are, Bonus points. When you can pronounce what is in your food, you are on the right track to helping your body cope with stress from the inside out. You see, a well-balanced and nutritious diet plays a critical role in supporting your body's ability to cope with stress. The quote, clean foods that are from the earth and are the least processed, they're the foods that are the most rich in vitamins and minerals and antioxidants that support your overall health and positively bring benefits like impacting your mood and your energy levels. 
So build on this simple nutrition that supports coping with stress by not only looking towards more clean, natural ingredients, but focus on some fuel specifically with omega-3 fatty acids. You can find those in um, quite a few different varieties of fish, but if you are looking for more vegetarian options, turn to flax seeds and walnuts. As a bonus... And why omega-3s are helping you to cope with stress, omega-3s help your brain as well as reducing inflammation in your body, helping with the lubrication and the strength of your joints and muscles. Win, win, win. So another huge piece of simple nutrition to cope with stress is hydration and avoiding excess caffeine in, and enjoying caffeine and sugar in moderation. So again, let's focus on the hydration, bringing those things in and really mindfully eating when you're doing, um, eating things that have higher caffeine or higher sugar content. This will help support a stable mood and promote a more effective holistic stress response, meaning body and mind. Now, overall, focusing on foods such as fruits and vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, they provide the essential nutrients that you need. But to support you even more, I've included a link, the coping with stress using simple nutrition food list. It's down there below. Just take it one step at a time bringing in foods that sound and feel the best for you and keep practicing the coping with stress, a body balance meditation as you continue to grow your resilience and empower your lifelong wellness in a way that works. Until next time, namaste.